HBO Max is taking away Elmer Fudd's signature guns in the new Looney Tunes series. His signature firearms to kill the Wasco Wabbit Bugs Bunny will now be a scythe. And some people are not too happy about this change for the fictional character. Well, my reaction is it's typical liberal control. They can't beat us at the ballot box. So slowly, continuously, they will destroy the image of firearms in America today. So does it matter that this fictional character is losing this signature prop, but not others? And he always had the shotgun with him. You know, now they want to take away the firearms, but they'll still let them blow things up with dynamite, do stuff like that. It's just a way of controlling us. Others seem to acknowledge that society has changed. Um, Looney Tunes, you know, they've had a history of characters that they've, that were based on disgusting racial stereotypes. And I know that those sorts of things have been edited and changed. Looney Tunes is not real and therefore none of the characters are real. Manchester recognizes that there is a difference between reality and cartoon. Very much farcical and in the rules of farce there's no true uh, pain and no lasting injury. Difference, I think, between the slapsticky type of violence and things like guns, which, uh, you know, we have a problem with in this country. We have a problem with young people and guns in this country. And the immediacy of that kind of violence is unforgiving. The Second Amendment will not change. Just the representation of firearms will be removed from a fictional man who does not have the best aim. Elmer Fudd was not a responsible gun haver. He didn't practice gun safety. So I would almost think as a gun safety advocate, you wouldn't want to showcase somebody like Elmer Fudd with a gun. Others think this change is not for the better. Or a lot like Chairman Mao said, I can change a country in one generation through education. This is them changing a generation's outlook about firearms through education. Emma Rose Lewis, YourEerie.com.